Hello and welcome to Sherwood Phoenix Piano's www.sherwoodphoenix.co.uk is our website folks. Thanks for watching. Uh, I'm Stephen Pringle and this is uh, Robert Warnham, Baby Grand Trope Boudoir Grand Piano. Uh, these pianos, uh, I've actually got two of them, one of which was just sold to a, a fellow piano dealer. Um, these pianos are actually historical pianos, um, antique pianos. And this has got a particularly interesting situation. A lot of people, even in the piano trade, won't have seen one of these. Um, Robert Burnham designed a, an action called a, a downstriking action, which Brian, if Brian comes in here with the camera, um, will show you roughly what that is. Likewise, we've done this on our last video of the other one. Um, as you can see, the hammer strikes down from above the string. Um, it hits the string from above rather than underneath. Um, these pianos also don't have an iron frame in them, so they're very light. Uh, the, the construction of this was uh, prehistoric in comparison to pianos of today, but um, realistically these are, these are kind of museum pieces rather than instruments. This one needs... It needs putting right as far as the action is concerned, but it's still, it's still wanting to work. Um, all the ivories are intact, uh, the, the casework needs a little bit of attention here and there, um, some broken veneer. In fairness, this, this one, the case is probably better than the other one that was sold last week. Um, again, we, we hope to keep this, uh, this or well, one of these two pianos in order to keep in the showroom just as a, a kind of historic piece just for, for a talking point. But unfortunately, we've just not got the space just now um, with, with some of our current plans for our new showroom, so uh, the piano's got to go, someone will get an opportunity at it and it would be a lovely, a lovely thing to get, get back up and running again. Any questions about the piano, give us a call. It's um, made circa 1845, the length is 6 foot 6 from the front of the keyboard to the back of the tail and it's 4 foot 2 inches wide. It's an 82 note keyboard um, and what more can I say, if you look Robert Warnham up, you will find a lot of information about the piano company. Um, they were based in London and um, there's a lot of information on Wikipedia about them. Um, and they, they are quite, quite a piece of history. So any questions at all, give us a call and we look forward to hearing from you. Bye for now.